The Kermadec Islands in Maori are a subtropical island arc in the South Pacific Ocean 800 to 1000 kilometers 500 to 620 miles northeast of New Zealand's North Island and a similar distance southwest of Tonga. The islands are part of New Zealand, 33 square kilometers, 12.7 square miles in total area and nowadays uninhabited except for the permanently manned Raoul Island station, the northernmost outpost of New Zealand. The islands are listed with the New Zealand outlying islands. The islands are an immediate part of New Zealand, but not part of any region or district, but instead area outside territorial authority, like all the other outlying islands except the Solander Islands. History Polynesian people settled the Kermadec Islands in around the 14th century and perhaps previously in the 10th century, but the first Europeans to reach the area—the Lady Penryn in May 1788—found no inhabitants. The islands were named after the Breton captain Jean-Michel Huon de Kermadec, who visited the islands as part of the D'Entrecasteaux expedition in the 1790s. European settlers, initially the Bell family, lived on the islands from the early 19th century until 1937, as did whalers. One of the Bell daughters, Bessie Dyke, recounted the family's experience there to writer Elsie K. Morton, who published the story in 1957 as Crusoe's of Sunday Island. <laughs> Raoul Island Station The station consists of a government meteorological and radio station, and a hostel for Department of Conservation Officers and Volunteers, that has been maintained since 1937. It lies on the northern terraces of Raoul Island, at an elevation of about 50 metres 160 feet, above the cliffs of Fleetwood Bluff. It is the northernmost inhabited outpost of New Zealand. Topic. Nuclear testing proposals. In 1955 the British government required a large site remote from population centres to test the new thermonuclear devices it was developing. Various islands in the South Pacific and Southern Oceans were considered, along with Antarctica. The Admiralty suggested the Antipodes Islands. In May 1955, the Minister for Defence, Selwyn Lloyd, concluded that the Kermadec Islands would be suitable. They were part of New Zealand, so Eden wrote to the Prime Minister of New Zealand, Sydney Holland, to ask for permission to use the islands. Holland refused, fearing an adverse public reaction in the upcoming 1957 general election in New Zealand. Despite reassurances and pressure from the British government, Holland remained firm. Geography <laughs> <laughs> The islands lie within 29 degrees to 31.5 degrees south latitude and 178 degrees to 179 degrees west longitude, 800 to 1,000 kilometers (500 to 620 miles) northeast of New Zealand's North Island, and a similar distance southwest of Tonga. The center of the Kermadec Islands group is located at approximately 29 degrees 16 minutes 37 seconds south 177 degrees 55 minutes 24 seconds west. The total area of the islands is 33.08 square kilometers 12.77 square miles. Topic. Climate The climate of the islands is subtropical, with a mean monthly temperature of 22.4 degrees Celsius .3 degrees Fahrenheit in February and 16.0 degrees Celsius .8 degrees Fahrenheit in August. Rainfall is approximately 1,500 mm annually, with lower rainfall from October through January. Islands The group includes four main islands three of them might be considered island groups, because the respective main islands have smaller islands close by and some isolated rocks, which are, from north to south. Raoul Island or Sunday Island is by far the largest of the islands. It is located at 29 degrees 16 minutes 0 seconds south 177 degrees 55 minutes 10 seconds west, 900 kilometers 560 miles south-southwest of Ada, the southernmost island of Tonga, and 1,100 kilometers 680 miles north-northeast of New Zealand. Raoul Island has an area of 29.38 square kilometers 11. 
34 square miles with numerous smaller satellite islands. Moumoukai Peak is 516 meters, 1693 feet high. Macaulay Island, the second largest, is located at 30 degrees 14 s 178 degrees 26 w, 110 kilometers 68 miles south-southwest of Raoul Island, Mount Hazard with an elevation of 238 meters 781 feet, area 3.06 square kilometers 1.18 square miles with neighboring island, Hazard Island. McDonald Rock is about 4 kilometers 2.5 miles north of Macaulay Island at 30 degrees 11 s 178 degrees 26 w. Curtis Island, the third largest, is located at 30 degrees 32 minutes 32 seconds south 178 degrees 33 minutes 39 seconds west, 35 kilometers 22 miles south-southwest of Macaulay Island, 137 meters 449 feet high, area 0 0.59 square kilometers 0 0.23 square miles with neighboring Cheeseman Island. Nugent Island is the northernmost island. It is located at 29 degrees 13 minutes 54 seconds south 177 degrees 52 09 w. It is approximately 100 meters 109 yards across. L'Espérance Rock, formerly French Rock, is 80 kilometers 50 miles south-southwest of Curtis Island at 31 degrees 26 s 178 degrees 54 w, 250 meters 820 feet in diameter, 0 0.05 square kilometers 0 0.019 square miles in area, 70 meters 230 feet high. Lavre Rock, about 8 kilometers (5.0 miles) north northwest of L'Espérance Rock, near 31 degrees 21 s (178 degrees 59 w), submerged, barely above water during low tide. Seamounts north and south of the Kermadec Islands are an extension of the ridge running from Tonga to New Zealand. See geology. Star of Bengal Bank, 103 kilometers (64 miles) south southwest of L'Espérance Rock, with a least depth of 48 meters (157 feet). Topic: Geology. The islands are a volcanic island arc formed at the convergent boundary where the Pacific Plate subducts under the Indo-Australian Plate. The subducting Pacific Plate created the Kermadec Trench, an 8 km deep submarine trench, to the east of the islands. The islands lie along the undersea Kermadec Ridge, which runs southwest from the islands towards the North Island of New Zealand and northeast towards Tonga, Kermadec -Tonga Arc. The four main islands are the peaks of volcanoes that rise high enough from the seabed to project above sea level. There are several other volcanoes in the chain that do not reach sea level, but form seamounts with between 65 and 1,500 meters of water above their peaks. Manawai Seamount, with a depth of 120 meters over its peak, is midway between Raoul Island and Tonga. 100 kilometers south of L'Espérance Rock is the little explored star of Bengal Bank, probably with submarine volcanoes. Further south are the South Kermadec Ridge Seamounts, the southernmost of which, Rumble IV Seamount, is just 150 km north of the North Island of New Zealand. The ridge eventually connects to White Island in New Zealand's Bay of Plenty, at the northern end of the Taupo Volcanic Zone. The islands experience many earthquakes from plate movement and volcanism. Raoul and Curtis are both active volcanoes. The volcanoes on the other islands are currently inactive, and the smaller islands are the eroded remnants of extinct volcanoes. From 18 to 21 July 2012, Havre Seamount near Havre Rock erupted, breaching the ocean surface from a depth of more than 1,100 meters and producing a large raft of pumice floating northwest of the volcano. The eruption was not directly observed, but it was located using earthquake and remote sensing data after the pumice raft was spotted by aircraft and encountered by HMNZS Canterbury. Environment Flora The islands are recognized by ecologists as a distinct ecoregion, the Kermadec Islands subtropical moist forests. They are a tropical and subtropical moist broadleaf forests ecoregion, part of the Oceania ecozone. The forests are dominated by the red-flowering Kermadec pohutakawa, related to the pohutakawa of New Zealand. 
The islands are home to 113 native species of vascular plants, of which 23 are endemic, along with mosses 52 native species, lichens and fungi 89 native species. Most of the plant species are derived from New Zealand, with others from the tropical Pacific. 152 non-native species of plants introduced by humans have become established on the islands. Dense subtropical forests cover most of Raoul, and formerly covered Macaulay. Metrosideros kermitacensis is the dominant forest tree, forming a 10 to 15 meter high canopy. A native Nikau palm, Rapalostylus bowery, is another important canopy tree. The forests had a rich understory of smaller trees, shrubs, ferns, and herbs, including Merzine kermitacensis, Lobelia anseps, Poa polyphylla, Coprosma acutifolia, and Coriaria arborea. Two endemic tree ferns, Cyathea milne and the rare and endangered Cyathea kermitacensis, are also found in the forests. Areas near the seashore and exposed to salt spray are covered by a distinct community of shrubs and ferns, notably Myoporum obscurum, Coprosma petiolata, Asplenium obtusatum, Cyperus ustilatus, Dysphyma astrali, and Ficinia nodosa. Fauna <laughs> <laughs> The islands have no native land mammals. An endemic bird subspecies is the Kermadec red-crowned parakeet. The group has been identified as an important bird area by BirdLife International because of its significance as a breeding site for several species of seabirds, including white-necked and black-winged petrels, wedge-tailed and little shearwaters, sooty terns and blue noddies. The area also hosts rich habitats for cetaceans. In recent years, increased presences of humpback whales indicate Kermadec Islands functioning as migratory colliders, and varieties of baleen not in great numbers and toothed whales including mink whales, sperm whales, less known beaked whales, killer whales, and dolphins frequent in adjacent waters. Vast numbers of southern right whales were historically seen in southwestern areas although only a handful of recent confirmations exist around Raoul Island. The deep sea hydrothermal vents along the Kermadec Ridge support diverse extremophile communities, including the New Zealand blind vent crab. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Conservation. The introduction of cats, rats, and goats devastated the forests and seabirds. Overgrazing by goats eliminated the forests of Macaulay Island, leaving open grasslands, and altered the understory of Raoul Island. Predation by rats and cats reduced the seabird colonies on the main islands from millions of birds to tens of thousands. The New Zealand government has been working for the last few decades to restore the islands. New Zealand declared the islands a nature reserve in 1937, and the sea around them a marine reserve in 1990. Goats were removed from Macaulay in 1970 and from Raoul in 1984, and the forests have begun to recover. The islands are still known for their bird life, and seabird colonies presently inhabit offshore islets, which are safe from introduced rats and cats. Efforts are currently underway to remove the rats and cats from the islands, as well as some of the invasive exotic plants. Visits to the islands are restricted by the Department of Conservation. The department allows visits to Raoul by volunteers assisting in environmental restoration or monitoring projects, and other visitors engaged in nature study. Visits to the other islands are generally restricted to those engaged in scientific study of the islands. On 29 September 2015, New Zealand Prime Minister John Key announced the creation of the Kermadec Ocean Sanctuary, a 620,000 square kilometres 239,383 square miles protected area in the Kermadec Islands region. References Topic. External links Kermadec Marine Reserve at the New Zealand Department of Conservation. Kermadec Islands Subtropical Moist Forests. Terrestrial Ecoregions. World Wildlife Fund. The Kermadecs, an ocean wilderness. Kermadec Islands Marine Reserve at Seafriends. Kermadec Ocean Sanctuary from the Ministry for the Environment, Manitou Mo Te Taiao.